Good afternoon, food lovers. We are live on location at Tosabi, home of the sushi burrito. This show seems familiar. If you remember that we were at Wasabi with him, you're right. And goes to show his passion and knowledge for sushi goes above and beyond. Today, we are making the Tosabi, Dumping and Happy Buddha, as well as the Salmon and Tuna Poke. All these food items are a remix of traditional Far East flavors to bring you convenience, simplicity, and delicious all-in-one bite and more. Let's get Cho to show us how it's done. Hey guys! Hi there! Well, thanks for having me here again. <laughs> thanks for having us yeah. on the show. So what are we making? We're making the... Uh... Yeah, today we're going to make our famous uh, sushi burrito. So okay. We're, yeah, we're going to start off with the uh, chosabi burrito. Okay. Well, obviously, it's named after the restaurant. Right, so right. Yeah, it's like a Big Mac, you know? Okay, <laughs> it's like the Big Mac. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, here we have June. June's going to demonstrate how we make a uh, chosabi burrito. Go ahead, June. So, so what inspired you to um, to open up a sushi burrito restaurant? You know, we, we're, we, we obviously know that we own wasabi. Yes. Yeah. You know, when you're eating sushi, it's very kind of harder to eat, right? You could have like sit down, chopsticks. It's fancy. I like yeah, it. Like I like that. eating the I chopsticks know. then. You yeah. know, it's like an art, right? Right. Here, a burrito, you can actually, you know, take it anywhere. It's very easy. Okay. You know, you can eat in the car, in the park. Eat while or... you're walking to work. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Go ahead, June. Let's, uh, yeah, perfect. So that's a sushi rice that we have. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, same concept as well. Yes. So seaweed. Yeah. So what he's doing now is just uh, uh, putting the base down, which is the rice. So it's going to spread all over the seaweed. Okay. Look at how fast he's rolling or spreading it. Wow. Yeah. I remember when I made this with you before, my hands are all sticky. I couldn't even spread it. Yeah, with the glove, it sure helps oh, too, right? right, right. Yeah, so here we have tempura crumbs that's going to go into it. Okay. Yeah. For a nice crunch. Yeah, and we have a spicy mayo, aioli. Yeah, as you know, he's zigzagging it, right? So that yes. it, yeah. So it spreads? Exactly. Yeah, so a little bit sliced cucumber. Cucumber. Uh, crab meat. So the crab meat's got a little flavor in it. It's mayo okay. based. Okay, yeah. Uh, that comes all the way from Seattle. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, especially for our, for our, our brand. Got it. Yeah. And then what do we have? We have the avocado, avocado. Is this your most popular menu item? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's like we said. It's the, it's the Big Mac of Chosabi. Oh, right, the Big uh, Mac, Chosabi. yes. <laughs> <laughs> One million soul last year. <laughs> One million soul. <laughs> yeah, so you got tuna and salmon, so that's... Uh, Ahi tuna okay. and the uh, Atlantic salmon. Okay. Okay. So this is the final stage, right? That's right. So we've got to no close pressure, it up. No pressure, June. <laughs> so it's a big sushi roll. Wow, right? look at that. Yeah, so now we're going to take it to wrap it in a, a wrapping paper. Okay. Can you wrap it in three sheets? Um, no, no, oh, just, just, one, just one, yeah, because okay. we're doing the other one. Oh, okay. Yeah. I think this is an art too, wrapping it. So it's, it's really great for lunch, you know, like people at the office, right? Mm. And it's easy to travel as well because it's it's room temperature. It doesn't have to be super hot to eat sushi. Right. Yeah, so it's, it's really popular. So is it meat to eat this sushi burrito also? Yes. Yes? It looks pretty tight. Yeah. So the box that it goes into is its design box that you put in here. Okay. Yeah. So put it in the box in. Yep. Yeah. So that's why it's easy to travel. Oh, I see. Right. Yeah. The yeah. box fits. So it's perfectly for the sushi burrito. Exactly. Yeah. So you get the soy sauce, wasabi that goes into it. You see how after that you just peel it? Oh, I love it, that. Then it splits yes. into half. Okay. Yeah. yeah. It's perfect. Yeah. There you go. See? See how easy it is? Oh, it's heavy. Wow. <laughs> yeah. But I love how neat it is. Yeah, it's, a, it's nicely packaged, right? Mm -hmm. You get to the office, you just peel it. Open it, it yeah. And it splits right into half. Oh, it's perfect. Yeah. yeah I'll leave this wow. here. That's love good. it. All right. So we are, then we're going to get into the second one. The second one? So we're going to do the jumping shrimp, but we're going to deep fry the shrimp. Then we'll, okay. we'll get back to that. Then okay. we can do the happy Buddha first. Got it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to do the... I'm going to deep fry the uh, panko shrimp. Yeah. 
Okay, so we'll do that. And then June's gonna put the base in. So this one's more like, uh, uh, you know, the way when we came up with this row is inspired by Asian because they love mango. Okay. So it's gonna be a fresh mango that goes into this row. Oh, the sweet mango? Yeah, sweet mango. Oh, okay, love sweet mango. Yeah. Because there's two types of mangoes, right? There's a really sweet and soft one, and then there's that really sour, sour one. Sour one, yeah, yeah, the unripened one, right? Yeah, then yeah. that you have with fish sauce, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Cyril. Hi, Kathy. Hi, Vivs. Thanks for tuning in. Yeah, same concept as well. So the rice always go first. Okay. Yeah. Looks like he's been doing this for a while. Oh, eh? uh, June looks like an expert. Yeah. <laughs> and then the mayo again, zigzag. It's a fresh mango. Fresh mango. So then you have that nice sweet taste also. Yeah, it's kind of that sweet and sour, kind of quite refreshing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And you get a nice crunch from the cucumber as well. And more crab. Yeah. You can't go wrong with crab. I think crab's my favorite. Me too. Hi, Blessing. Thanks for tuning in, Blessing. Ready? Yeah. Oh, that was fast. Yeah, it takes about a shrimp, doesn't take long to cook. And is this coconut shrimp or is this uh, just no, panko? Oh, panko shrimp. Yeah. Oh, it smells so good. Yeah, look at that juicy, juicy. Mm -hmm. Even the camera guy is hungry, I think. I know, look at all. <laughs> We're all hovering over June. <laughs> yeah. How fast it is just to make this. You know, sushi he burrito. can make this less than a minute. Really? Yeah. Yeah. It's that's how quick it is. Okay. And when did you first open the restaurant? Uh, we opened about uh, five years ago. Five years ago. Yeah. It used to be a big line up here. It's it's crazy busy. I remember. Busy. You know, I used to see the sushi burritos on Instagram all the time, mm -hmm. and because I used to work downtown, right? Right. But it was there was lineups all the time, so I never really had a chance to come. Yeah. Well, now during COVID, right now there's nobody at the office, right. so usually it's it's very busy here at lunchtime. Okay. Time. And you have a few locations also. Um. Yes, we do. Yeah, we have we used to have five, so we shut down two because of COVID. Okay. So, yeah. So right now we have the uh, Portage location, the King location, and mm -hmm. the uh, Taylor location. I see. So if you guys are watching, please support local. Is that how it's normally served? Yeah, yeah that's when it's dining. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah dining. So, you know, it's unfortunately. <laughs> right, right. We're yeah. shut down due to COVID. Yeah, I just love the packaging. You know, I it's know. It's so easy. It's brilliant. Yeah. You know, it's... I've never, I think this is the only restaurant chain in Winnipeg that has the sushi burrito. Is that correct? Uh, yeah, that's correct. Yeah. Yeah, we're, we're one of the first ones to start it in Canada. Oh, actually. okay. Yeah. See? Take that to the office or to church on a Sunday, to maybe? To church on a Sunday. <laughs> Yeah. Treat someone. Well, we have actually on my way to work. Somebody called me. Mm -hmm. They wanted 50 burritos. 50 burritos. Yeah, for like for the staff on okay. Monday. So you know that's nice. They're supporting local business. Right. I love it. So love do you it. do catering then? Yeah, we do. Okay. Yeah. And this is the last one. So this is the vegetarian one. And happy Buddha. Happy, happy. We call it. If you're not happy, we'll make you happy. I have a member here asking, do you offer gluten-free bowls? Uh, yes, we do. Okay, wonderful. And then you have a new product, the Hawaiian one? Yeah, this, yeah the uh, Spam Rito. Okay, yes. Yeah, we do have that as well. Hi, Rachel. Hi, Barb. Thanks for watching. What sauce was that? Uh, that's a sweet soy sauce. Oh, the sweet soy yeah. sauce. Okay. okay so, so, yeah, oh, sesame, sesame seeds, seeds soy also? sauce. Um, stock and mushrooms that we made in-house here. You make it in-house? Yeah, yeah. So we, you know, we soak it overnight and then right. we cook it with uh, mirin, sake, mm -hmm. and soy sauce. And uh, same thing with the tofu. Oh, Sweet. this is tofu? Yeah. It looks different. Yeah, it's a deep fried tofu. Oh, it's deep fried yeah, tofu. Yeah, after we deep fry it and then it gets marinated into uh, sweet soy. Okay. I love how you have this vegetarian option. 
And then you got some edamame. Edamame. And then carrot, some nice color and crunch. Nice color, crunch, yep. And then what's this? Uh, kale. Oh, kale. Yeah. A superfood. Yeah, we can alter a lot of stuff. At the other location, you can build your own burrito as well. Okay. Yeah, at the King location, we don't do it because it's big lineup at lunchtime, oh, so I it see, slows right. us down. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, we do offer stuff online as well right now. You know, can, uh, we're actually uh, celebrating 22 years of Wasabi Group. Oh, 22 so, years. Yeah, yeah. So Wasabi Restaurant, uh, Choji Ramen, Wasabi, 15% mm -hmm. yes. off for two weeks. 15% off for yeah. two weeks. Two Whoa. weeks, yeah. Good to know. Yeah, yeah, just a celebration and of it's January. Of 22 years. Yeah, I'm, I'm still standing here. It's <laughs> <laughs> a big milestone. That's it crazy. is, it is. years. Feels like yesterday. Feels like yesterday. <laughs> you know, I believe it. Yeah. Time just flies by. Exactly. Look at how beautiful it is. Do you can hold that up, please? Yeah. You know what? That is beautiful. Ooh, yeah, well, can't wait till you taste it. Oh my, I can't wait. It's amazing. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you got the sweetness and the, the flavor of the shiitake mushroom as well. The kale, the tofu, edamame, it's got that little creaminess to it. Okay, so what inspired you to build this menu? Um, you know, it's, it's just like I said, I was looking for something that's a lot easier to eat than a box of sushi, mm -hmm. right? So mm -hmm. you know, I came across with, uh, started in California, I think we have one location back then. Yeah. So I brought the concept here and it just took, took off. It's crazy. I love it. Yeah. It was and, so fast. Yeah. But with the, uh, with the Poke Bowl is when I, I was um, on vacation with the family in, in Hawaii. Okay. And uh, anywhere you go in Hawaii, in Maui, you yes. go to Poke, right? Yeah. Tuna Poke. Yeah. Yeah. So I brought that here and it, it's, it's ever since then, it's like, you know, it took off right away. Yeah, it's uh, and it's very healthy for you. It is. You know, I've never actually had a poke bowl. And no. I've been to Hawaii so many times, I've never had it. Oh, you got to have poke bowl when you go to Hawaii. Yeah. So the next one we're going to do is tuna and salmon poke okay. bowl. Nice. Yeah. Again, you have uh, ahi tuna, mm -hmm. okay, Atlantic salmon. Um, you can have a choice of rice base or salad base or noodle. Okay. Yeah, so right now we're just gonna do the rice. Let's do the rice. Yeah, yes. us Asian, we love rice. Oh, yeah. Except noodles. Actually, I really love noodles too. <laughs> okay, so you just got a little, little salad in there, a little cucumber. So we have one question. If you don't like rice, or sorry, if you don't like seaweed, can you use another base? To wrap it? Uh, not, you... not the burrito. Not the but burrito. But we can always make like a bowl burrito for you. Oh, okay. As well, yeah. So you don't have a substitution for the seaweed. Can no. you use rice paper? Um, uh, yeah, we could. You could. Yeah, but uh, I think it's harder because oh. it's, it's wet, right? Oh, right, right. Yeah, it's yeah. harder. But then we can always do it like in a bowl for you. Like, right. like say jumping shrimp, you, mm -hmm. you want it in a, a bowl form. Mm -hmm. We call the seaweed. We can do that as well. Okay. Yeah, so the onions there. So our sauce is, um, it's our in-house sauce. We make them here. Top secret. Can't tell you what is, what's in there. So what's in it? <laughs> <laughs> so we have two bowls here then. Uh, one, so it's going to marinate that. Oh, you're going to marinate yeah. it. I see. Yeah, so it's going to do a little bit of marinade in there. Look at the color of that tuna. Mm. It's beautiful. Hey, after a workout, this is perfect food. You know? Yeah, after workout. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah, I'll come here for yeah. an extra what fifteen percent off. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it started. Yeah, it started on yeah, yeah. started on the Thursday, so it's gonna run for two weeks. Yeah, for those that want to support local business, please do. And what are your hours like here on the King Street location? Uh, here we open eleven to six. Okay. Uh, we used to open till like later, but mm -hmm. during COVID, there's literally nobody here after after four o'clock. So, okay. Yeah, hopefully everything comes back to life shortly. Look at that. And what's this? That's a deep fried wonton chips. Deep fried wonton chips. Yeah, a little bit crispy on. We got the wasabi aioli. Goes on top. Okay, I'm going to season it with this, like a More little seaweed. Oh, seaweed. Yeah, seaweed, a little bit of uh, uh, sesame seed as well. Okay. Yeah, look at that. And there you have it, guys. This is a salmon and tuna poke bowl. Well, thank you, Toe, for letting me come back to your restaurant. Thanks for having us. It's been a pleasure. Well, thank you. And thank you, June, here. Yes, thank yeah, thank you, June. Yeah, yeah, yeah come and visit so June. <laughs> yeah.
So guys, once again, uh, Toe is offering 15% off for the next two weeks. If you're hungry, support local. Yeah. Thanks for tuning in. Go visit us at wasabigroup.com. I'll see you guys next week. Bye now. All right. Sounds good.